reflux setup. I have a piss pour trickle. We have some reflux. Not a whole lot. Mainly right there in the adapter. Not adapter, the ground glass joint, you know what I mean? Got a little bit of uh, potassium thalamide kind of chucking along on the top, but I've noticed it's decreasing in size, so we'll get there. Nothing really exciting. A little reflux of bromobutane, but no, nothing else. Alright, you really can't see anything due to the condensation, but uh, the face has become quite mobile. Um, you can probably see some K-thalamide going through. Uh, mild, mild reflux still. We're about one hour after cranking on the heat. Uh, reflux starts now. Just a quick note, there's a minor change in color. And we are almost at 140 C. I don't know if you can see, uh, right in there, there's a fine line of uh, potassium bromide cool, like kind of sticking to the side. Um, this is the result of the, uh, I believe it's SN2 reaction. It is um, making butyl thalamide with uh, potassium bromide since we started with potassium thalamide and bromobutane. Just a cool little point to make. Alright, here we go. After 2.5 hours, we have a darker DMSO with probably some uh, uh, bromobutane still in it, probably some potassium thalamide too. But on the other hand, we have um, butyl thalamide in here, which is our product. And as you can see, lots of potassium bromide. Very cool. This is all I have time for today, so I'll have to stop and uh, return later to uh, finish this. But for now, I'm going to store this in a bucket with anhydrous magnesium sulfate to help with the water and the air. Uh, but that's all for now. Uh, get ready for the next part. Alright, I, I don't know why I didn't film, but uh, if you can see, there's... Uh, and butyl thalamide, right there, just kind of caked all around. I wish I would have grabbed the phone to record beforehand because um, there was some really nice potassium chloride in there, or bromide, sorry, huge crystals. Anyways, nonetheless, um, we have our product. Um, it stinks like absolute crap. Horrifying. Got a little on my finger and I'm <laughs> struggling not to gag. But, um, so we're going to filter this. We're using plastic and uh, a disposable funnel so we uh, don't stink up any more glassware. Uh, but it's also nitric acid. So uh, we'll be doing a little bit of this just to kind of finish the first half. Uh, get going on it.